And another one for the Minnesota Vikings. Okay, Minnesota, not only do they pick up Jonathan Grenard, not only do they pick up Andrew Van Ginkle, two really good line outside linebackers, but now you bring in probably one another most improved player from last season, right? We, Jonathan Grenard was one of them for Houston, and now Blake Cashman, a Houston native. Let's see what Tom Pelissero had to say. Now, Homecoming, the Vikings are signing a Minnesota native linebacker Blake Cashman to a three-year deal worth up to 25 million. Guys, wait till you hear stats from this season. You guys are gonna love Blake Cashman. But without any further ado, let's get right into what he's gonna bring to the Vikings. Actually, before we do that though, comment down below a letter grade and also subscribe if you're new. Join the family, non-stop Vikings videos for the rest of the offseason. But let's get right in. All right, here we go. So Blake Cashman is a guy who is 27 years old, out of Minnesota, 6'1", 237 pounds. But last season, he broke out. He first started his career in New York, then moved on to Houston for the 2022 season. But under D'Amico Ryans, this man found his top potential, gaining over 106 tackles in 14 games. He missed some games and still clips that 100 mark. 56 of those were total. He also brought in two sacks, an interception, 11 and a half run stuffs, and five pass deflections as well. This dude could do it all. He can stop the run. He can get in the pass coverage. He can do anything you want him to do. Get to the quarterback even with some mid, um, you know, some double mug blitzes, right? But with that being said, we literally just talked about what they needed to do next after getting Van Geekel. Go check out that video and the Jonathan Grenard video. Those videos are out right now. But after getting those two guys, we said they need an interior linebacker, right? Troy Dye, free agent. Jordan Hicks, free agent. You have Ivan Pace, who I think is going to be really, really good. But now you add another guy in the left outside linebacker, Blake Cashman, right? This is huge. This is a day one starter in my opinion. And now your linebacker room looks completely overhauled, right? You lose Danielle Hunter, you lose Jordan Hicks, and now you bring in Jonathan Grenard, you bring in Andrew Van Ginkle, and you bring in Blake Cashman. This is a much improved linebacker core coming from last season. Now, last year, they ranked number 13 in rush attempts allowed per game, number 3 in offensive or, um, you know, rush yards allowed per rush number six in rush yards allowed per game and number 12 in rushing touchdowns allowed per game now listen that's going to get boosted up a little bit but also the main thing i want to say is their sack percentage is going to fly up they rank number 21 which is near you know the bottom of the league in terms of sack percentage well yeah blake cashman andrew van ginkle and jonathan grenard are going to immediately help their game going forward now i love this signing i think they got him for a relatively cheap deal for the season he's coming off of but let me know in the comments down below what do you think the vikings need to do next we talked a little bit about you know obviously the quarterback position who should they draft who should they sign who should they go out and try to trade for there's guys like justin fields available or the bo nixes the michael Penixes, um or they can trade up to a top three pick who knows what's going to happen but then again you know you lose kirk cousin and francy to the falcons they need to get a quarterback right if they don't get a quarterback i don't even know if justin jefferson will want to stay on the team so there's a lot of big things that are to come for minnesota and don't worry because we will be here for it all Comment down below your letter grade. Let me know what you guys think. Hit the like button. Subscribe if you're new. Join the family. But in my opinion, this is a big addition for the Minnesota Vikings once again.